All right, very excited about this one. This is another Southern Tier beer. We've done uh, a few of these uh, lately uh, out of Lakewood at New York. Uh, this is Southern Tier Live, which is uh, their pale ale. They call it a session pale ale, citrusy session pale ale. Comes into us at 5.5%. Usually with session beers, you think of maybe below 5. So 5.5% called a session ale is, uh, I don't know, maybe a little sketchy. Uh, it is, uh, an American Pale Ale, as I mentioned. Uh, gets an 88 on Beer Advocate, which is very good. Gets a 96 on Rape Beer, which is really excellent. And it says, strong citrus hops balanced with malt breadiness. Uh, they created the label to, uh, have the feeling of live music. So they have, like, ticket stubs. Kind of a jumble of stuff there. I don't know if the camera's really picking it up as well as it could, but, uh, there's their ticket stubs. Any band's names on here? Uh, I see Six Flags, maybe. Uh, Sonic Youth? Is that Sonic Youth? Um, wow, you could really go through here and really pick out the blah, the blah. What's B-L-A? What could that be? The blah. Um, it's cut off, obviously. Rolling, maybe Rolling Stones, World Tour, Sky Dome, Toronto. Love it. Uh, the Cra at Six Flags. Cranberries? <laughs> I don't know. Flaming Lips? I see Flaming Lips. Wow, this is, you could really, it'd be really neat if each bottle had, like, a different collection of ticket stubs, and you can really, like, look at, like, what bands are, uh, are what here. So let's open it up and, uh, pour this into this shaker glass, kind of a pint glass, stout glass, if you will, and let's see what we got here from Southern Tier Live. Very citrusy look to it. Very yellowy. Um, just really wheat uh, look. Um, you see the orange kind of pour with a nice frothy head, maybe about three quarters of a finger or so, maybe a little bit more than that. Um, decent look to it. Um, very, very cloudy uh, as well. Kind of a cloudy, uh, cloudy citrusy looking lemony pour. So let's get the aroma of Southern Tier Live. Getting a dank, uh, dank smell, which is par for the course for grip for uh, uh, American pale ales. Orangey, definitely an orangey smell. Maybe a little mango in there, but just kind of a dank uh, East Coast kind of pale ale smell, kind of uh, you know par for the course for an East Coast ale. Let's get the taste now of Southern Tier Live. Oh, this is excellent. Um, at the front of the tongue, I'm definitely getting that orange sensation, and then it gets bitter toward the back. Hoppy, very uh, light, citrusy kind of taste to the beer. Uh, I much enjoy it. I really, I really do. Uh, Got to say, this is one of the better pale L's that I've had in a long time. Um, It is so darn lemony. I love it. I love the uh, the lemon citrus uh, kind of taste of it. It's definitely kind of a summer beer, even though I believe it's year-round. I think this is their flagship or their regular pale ale, if I'm not mistaken. Their kind of flagship pale ale. Um, I'm going to go ahead and give Southern Tier Live, uh, you know, yeah, I'm going to give it a 10 out of 10. This is a, this is a perfect pale ale for me. Um, great look to it. Great light look. Great summery kind of uh, citrus kind of look and taste. Um, perfect amount of orangey kind of taste in the forefront and perfect amount of bitter uh, taste in the back. So uh, great representation of the style, a 10 out of 10 for Southern Tier Live.